So we've made our way over to Galaxy's Edge, and I think I mentioned in my Disney World Galaxy's Edge video that I thought Galaxy's Edge over in Disney World was a little bigger, had a lot more spaces, and I'm not sure I'm right about that. We've walked through this area, and there are different sections that you can walk in. Obviously, it's a little more linear. You can walk through. You can get up to the big area where the Millennium Falcon Smuggler's Run Ride is. Um, and it's, it's, a, it's very similar in plan. Obviously, the layout at Disneyland is much different. Most, most, most of the stuff here is much smaller. Uh, Tomorrowland, much smaller. Um, uh, obviously, the castle is much smaller here. But overall, uh, it's got the same feel and flavor as uh, Galaxy's Edge in Disney World. Looks like we'll need recon in this sector. Hold on, remember, we've got eyes everywhere. Looks like you work with droids. The first order could use someone with your skills. Carry on. So we're getting ready to go on Smuggler's Run. It's only about a 20 minute wait. It is uh, 8 30 at night, so the crowds have died down. 20 minutes we thought was pretty reasonable to wait. We actually just walked right on and we're getting close to entering the Millennium Falcon. No. Are we going to be gunners? No, I want to be a pilot. So last time we were on this ride, she didn't allow us to become pilots. We had to be gunners. I want to be a pilot. I'm scared to be a pilot because I don't know what you're doing anymore. People get mad at you. It's fine. We will be fine. Hello, hello, my friend. I am Hondo Onaka, and this is Onaka Transport Solutions. Today, I am offering the opportunity of a lifetime. I need flight crews to transport this valuable merchandise across the galaxy. Pilots to navigate, engineers to operate the ship, and gunners to defend the shipments. And that is where you come in. Oh, the Millennium Falcon. Oh, no. My wife ruined it again. We do not get to be pilots. Okay. Well, she's laughing because we're not engineers, or because we're engineers. And so we got, we got the shaft. Yeah, we were gunners. I don't even know what the engineer does. We should play space chess. shipment of coaxia. Gunners, you clear the path. Pilots, line up behind the train. And engineers, you harpoon that precious cargo. All right, into the cockpit. I hope you are ready, my friends. But I'm sure I will be coming along. I have anxiety already. I have anxiety. I'm nervous. Oh, I'm nervous. It's only weak. It's a lot of energy. Por favor, permanezcan sentados y cuide a los niños. Gracias. Right, 
enough that I think the crowds have died down quite a bit. You can see the fountain over here. It's really cool to see the full-size replica. <clears throat> Everybody's walking around with their lightsabers that they built at Savvy's Workshop. I'm going to do that in a couple of days. Do you want to try to do Rise of the Resistance or wait even longer? Well, I have a few minutes. We are waiting at the marketplace at Galaxy's Edge. We just got off Smuggler's Run. It was only about a 20 minute wait. It's late enough in the evening. Most of the people have left. The crowds have died down and it was quick to get on the ride. We had a lot of fun, but I did not get to be a pilot. So we're gonna have to try going on that ride again so that uh, I can be a pilot. We were uh, engineers. Uh, last time we did this in 2019, we were gunners. So I still want to be a pilot, so we're going to keep going on that ride till we become a pilot. Um, Rise of the Resistance should be accessible. When we were in Disney World earlier this year, we actually had to pay to get on um, the Disney Genie Plus Lightning Lane. Uh, we paid $15 each to get on the ride. Um, I think we're going to be able to walk on because, the, again, the lines are a lot less. The lines are a lot shorter than they were during earlier in the day. It was about a two-hour wait earlier in the day. But again, it's late enough that the crowds have died down a bit, so we should be able to get on. It's about 9 o'clock at night here in California. And uh, nice thing, we're, at, we're in uh, Disneyland in October, and they always do the, the Halloween themes. We just went on the Haunted Mansion. We had the Nightmare Before Christmas overlay, so... I always like to see that at Disneyland at the Haunted Mansion. All ships launch! I am Lieutenant Beck. As you heard from Ray, I have been tasked with getting you to Vakara. Red 2, Blue 5, keep it tight now. Let's get ready to make that jump to light speed on my mark. I want to get better than that. Black Leader. We're picking up an unusual signal. Are you spotting anything? Yeah, I see it. We'll check it out. BB-8, what do you got? They'll want the location of our secret base. Tell them nothing. The future of the Resistance is at stake. I have a bad feeling about this. Stand back from those doors. Thank you. 
to you. Follow us. Yes. Are your assigned number one? Are your assigned colors? Pull it down. Seatbelt securely fastened. Keep hands, arms, feet, and legs inside the transport and supervise your children. <laughs> Tell them it's a prisoner transfer. <laughs> Did it work? Good. Now get a move on. There's a clear path to the turbo lifts at the end of the hallway. Turn right. <laughs> You're lucky it didn't spot you. Take those turbo lifts and stay out of trouble. Hey, you're not authorized. Wait, the those are the prisoners. <laughs> Got up, rise of the resistance the second time. 
in the same year. Um, I actually filmed a lot more this time than I did. I'll show some additional footage from this trip, uh, just show a little more of the ride, but uh, it's a pretty good ride. It's a lot of, a lot of different elements to it. And actually, it said an hour wait, and I don't think we waited that long. We got we got through pretty quickly. So, it was like 30 minutes. yeah, thirty minutes. Um, another thing about the ride is is that uh, it's nighttime this time. Last time we went in the daytime, so it's a little different experience at night. Everything's lit up. You got the X-wing fighter up here. This Galaxy's Edge seems a little smaller than Disney World, so but there's a lot of a lot of the same elements. X-Wing fighter, A-Wing fighter, moisture evaporators everywhere. And it's about 10, 15 at night. Kind of tired, it's been a long day. So we will be back in a couple days to uh, build a lightsaber. Okay, so it's time for our Smuggler's Run Lightning Lane. I'm gonna try to get to be a pilot this time because we never got to do that. So we're gonna go stand in line. It should be less than 20 minutes to get in there and get to the captain's chair and pilot the Falcon. got word that the ride is delayed. Right? We've experienced a lot of broken rides since we've been here at uh, Disneyland this, this trip. Uh, the other day we were on Indiana Jones. That broke down while we were on it. Uh, there's been multiple rides that have been down. I just feel like for the amount you pay, the amount of times these rides are going down has been crazy. Okay, so we asked and we received. So we're going to pilot and uh, be a new experience, so let's give it a try. Okay, just got off of Smuggler's Run as pilots, had a good time. I controlled left, right, she controlled up and down. She also got to jump us into hyperspace, that wasn't fair. I wanted to jump into hyperspace. Our hyperdrive motivator was working. And uh, yeah, we had a good time. And we had a good group of other people, yeah. random people, yeah. in our, you know, <laughs> our engineers and our gunners. So we did good, but I've never gotten within two coaxium containers. I don't know what's going on there. <laughs> anyway, that's what we were getting. Anyway, we will see you on the next ride. Yeah.